see how we can sample inside Studio One. I have a sample from Splice that tells me it's 140 BPM, so I'm gonna adjust the tempo. I cannot play this right now before I change it a little bit. First thing that we need to do is to splice it up and we can choose either 4, 8, 16 or 32. I'm gonna go with 4 and and we can split a grid right here. So we have our chops and and the most usual thing is to open sample one take everything and before you let go you press shift and you have every file in here so we need to click the release uh, way down and mono so that the sounds don't clash and the release is down because when we lift our finger from the key uh, the sound stops so let's try something simple the metronome so we can have something like this but the way I do it I actually use Serato sample but when I sample in Studio One Let's say I have this, um, I click this one here. Uh, what this does is when I move this one here, they swap places. So let's see how we can sample that way. Um, let me um, select everything transpose it down So I go bit by bit. So this sounds fine. Um, I can reverse some of them. Let's see. So let's say we're going to keep that. I'm going to actually crossfade again. Or maybe. I'm going to add. Um, I assume everyone has um, half time. And we 
can use it like that or we can transpose see where it sounds good Let's add some drums real fast to make sure. Let's transpose it a little more. So yeah, that's the way I do it when I don't use Serato Sample. Um, I do it for like trumpets, violins, or even um, trap samples like this. So yeah, I hope that was helpful and I'm gonna see you very soon. Cheers.